Say goodbye to Dr. Scripps and horrible handwriting. In their place, typing and clicking. They're called electronic prescriptions, and starting March 27th in New York State, everyone will get their orders filled from the computer, or doctors will be penalized. Enables the state to go ahead and track these type of prescriptions, and track these doctors, and track how often they're prescribing it, and track how often the patient is taking it. It's state streamlining, but it's also aimed to keep controlled substances in check, especially opioids. Currently, the state has a database that prescribers can check just how many prescriptions their patients are getting. But this new system will connect the doctors directly with pharmacists, hoping to end drug shopping and fraud. I think it's a good thing because I think it allows everyone to know what drugs the patient is picking up from the same place. Yet some customers are concerned that the process to pick up their medication will take extra long. And if the medication at the pharmacy is either too expensive or not available, there will be no quick fix. Then they have to go ahead and recontact the prescriber to go ahead and resend it. And a lot of times in a hospital setting, you're dealing with hospitalists that by the time they get to the pharmacy, those doctors may not be back. It's going to take a while to get used to the new system. There's going to be, I'm sure, like a lot of quirks to fix. Maimonides will be going live with e-prescriptions on the 27th, but other hospitals in the city, including NYU Langone and the Mount Sinai Health System, are applying for waivers to get more time to roll out better tech systems. Reporting for Currents, I'm Michelle Powers.